going to show you what it's like to sleep at a truck stop. Just going to show you around my truck a little bit. All right, I'm just going to show you the inside of my truck. I just got this little bit of space up here in case I want to put some extra storage. This is where I sleep at night in the truck. I got a window on both sides of my head and my foot. And I got my blanket and pillow and all that good jazz. Up here in this cabinet, I have my chips and snacks and things that I keep up here. I got some uh, of these little strawberry shortcake snacks for breakfast in the morning. I got chips. This is my little hot logic that I warm my food in. I don't use a microwave. Um, I just got some other items up here. I keep my shoes down in this bin. I know you can't see that very well. Over here, I keep my camera and my laptop, all my electronics in this bin right here. Um, and down here, I got some tools. I got my ratchet set here in case I need to use them for anything on the truck. Uh, down here, I have a little slide out, it makes a little table. And if I want to eat food, I eat lunch. And I got my little cubby over here for like my cell phone, my contact case, my glasses. And then I got my lunch box down here that I keep by my side <clears throat> while I'm driving so that I don't have to stop the truck and come back here to retrieve it. I just leave it right there by my side. And I got my little refrigerator right here. This is a Black & Decker little spacious refrigerator. My wife makes me um, portioned meals each week. I got some uh, drinks down there and I got some salsa and I got my little coffee creamer. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go take a shower. Got my bag with my clothes in it. And right here in this bag, I have my toiletries. Deodorant, toothpaste, toothbrush. We have the key. Alright. Alrighty. Lots of truckers here today. This is the Petro Truck Stop. Uh, just north of Lexington, Virginia. Off of exit 205. Pretty big truck stop. Lots of truck drivers here. So this is the Petro Shopping Center. They have like a little mini mall with these restaurants in it. Pretty cool, pretty big place. There's most truck stops. Yeah, Popeye's Louisiana Kitchen. The Merchantile. It's like a little burger joint. This place even has a theater. Check this out. Theater at White's Destination Station. I need a shower. Okay. Uh, just a uh, debit card. Yeah. $14. So I'm driver ID 313. And when you look up at the screen here, it shows you driver ID 313, that's shower 17. So I gotta find shower 17, it's gonna be down here. All right, this is what the showers look like at a truck stop. There are private showers, and you got your toilet and your vanity right here. So it's completely private. They do give you towels at this place. Some places don't, but they do here. And you got your bench to sit down with. And the shower looks pretty nice. You know, it's relatively clean. They give you soap here. And you got your shelves for your soaps. And they even give you a fan up here. Oh wow, they even have a barber shop here at this truck stop. An outlet store here. Check it out, they even have a chiropractor. Wow. Oh man, I feel a whole lot better. Showers always make you feel better. Oh, looks like we got a flatbed part next to us. Boy, he got a little close, didn't he? Just a little close. All right, back in the truck and it's time for bed. We'll see y'all in the morning. Good night. Uh, well, it is about 4.36 in the morning. 
and I slept really good. It was nice and cool in the truck. It's nice and hot and humid outside, but it was cool in the truck. So we're gonna go get some coffee. Thank you so much. Me too. All right, guys, well, that about wraps it up for this video. Thanks for watching very much, and I hope you enjoyed this content. Let me know if you want to see something else in the future. I will be making a lot more content on this channel. And as always, please like and subscribe, and if you have any questions, let me know. And as always, take care. God bless you.